Hey guys! Welcome to another episode of Swamp Donkey Let's Play. I'm Yanin. And I'm Morris. And we're playing Farm Simulator. <laughs> Undead Farm Simulator. That's weird. Check. It's, it's, it's now. It's. Um, what's that? Sniper game. <laughs> Ash shot. <laughs> what sniper game is that? Uh, sniper Elite. Oh. Yeah, this is this is Dark Souls Sniper Elite Edition. <laughs> My pointy hat, no. <laughs> it was so beautifully pointed. Okay, as you guys can see, uh, Morris actually got himself a full set of the armor now. Yeah, I, uh, it's such finally a, the fucking thing such a done. mission. But it, like, the chest piece is the most important piece. And on this playthrough, unfortunately, it was the one that took the longest. Yeah. That's that's one of the reasons why it's a bit easier to start playing with a character like the knight, is because he already starts with pretty solid armor. It's I mean it's a good starting choice for that 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 plain benefit that is this the armor you get when you start out as the knight? No, or? you don't get a lot of knight armor. Oh, you okay. get you get the Dark Souls default it's, yeah pretty much i think it, it looks pretty much the same as the other dark souls games as far as i can remember or tell that i think that's why like i i, I think i said it to you uh, a bit earlier was that um like uh getting uh, uh, yeah check uh, this out it's uh, cool she's not wearing a hat at all and then you're like hey do you have an itch behind your head how do you i'll put my hat on <laughs> the hat on yeah, um, I, I said it to you earlier um, where uh, I realized that I'm not that into medieval games. I'm pretty sure the only like medieval game I really enjoy is Legend of Zelda, but that's still kind of like a, an outlier in it, you know? Yeah. Um, oh, well, she's a great, she makes a great pincushion, doesn't she? Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, like most armor in all games look the same to me. Really? Yeah. No, well, not like exactly the same but it's like oh i can see this being in another game you know? yeah well i feel dark souls has quite unique armors and then on the other hand anime rpgs i feel have really unique armors. okay yeah anime rpgs are like a differing thing it's the same as legend of zelda it's like they're designed very different and dark souls i feel also has some quite really unique and wacky memorable armor like mm -hmm. that fat guy armor from dark souls one yeah i'm uh, that, to, 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 to to like just add on to that like I mean the default ones or not the default ones but the common ones yeah the common ones always look all the same throughout all the games but it's that's the point of it like it's so intentional they know it looks similar to other games but the reason they choose to do it is um that when you start the game then you feel like oh this fucking boring ass they want it to be boring ass like ah oh, fuck this armor again you yeah. know it's ugly it's shit and you're motivated to be like i want to get something cool i want to be badass you know mm. i want to be able to shit on my enemy's face and look awesome at the same time that's kind of the the, the vibe that i think they go for uh, it's strange. You see, I have two slots for arrows. Mm. R1 shoots the top slot and R2 shoots the second slot. But if you run out of one of the slots, it doesn't automatically fire with the other slot. Um. So then he just grabs for arrows. <laughs> Die, little mage bong. I hate that arrows use stamina, though. Seriously, like, how can, how can an arrow... Tie, pull it, like, shooting one arrow tie you out at the same amount as... Um, do you, uh, do you know what? Like, I I can I can see why it takes stamina, but the way it takes stamina should should have been different. The longer you hold, the more stamina it takes. You know, so so it punishes you if if you if you like, you know, pull you know pull too too pull far too fast or, or yeah. you know too, for too long, because that feels to me like it it it, it, it would take concentration and stamina, not releasing. It. Oh, yeah. Well, none of us are really archers. So. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, still, I feel like. Swinging a sword around, it makes sense that it would tie you a bit faster than just shooting one arrow. Yeah. I mean, if you see some archers that can shoot, like, fuck fast and they can shoot lots. What's that other guy? There was a YouTube video, about, like, and that I think they said, like, this guy was basically, is basically a video game character. Because <laughs> he shoots, like, fuck him, fuck him, fuck him, fuck him. Fuck him, fuck him. And that's the exact... Fuck him in the ass. That, that's not the sound the arrow makes, that's just how he talks. <laughs> like, 
How do you feel about you know achieving this? Fuck <laughs> Oh god damn it, I hate these guys. They scare the balls off of me. The little, what do we call them, Gandalf? God damn it, is there another one that's gonna come kill me? Yeah, there is another one that's gonna come kill me. There's so many of these little midge mongs here. <laughs> midge mongs. <laughs> that's a Borderlands oh. reference. Uh, <laughs> there's something, did you get that stuff uh, down, down? No, uh, that's why I was shooting all these guys, because uh, it was like, and thank God I did, because there's so fucking many here. Yeah, they would so have dropped on you. They would have, with, uh, with those guys shooting from up there, doing so much damage. Wait, wait, I swear I saw one down this little path. Maybe you fucked up. No, uh, an item. Oh. Maybe it was just the light shining funny. Okay, but is that the whole point of this area? One fading soul. Fading soul, as far as I can remember, literally only gives you 50 souls when you use it. So I, fuck, I could have killed a farmer. <laughs> and not to get the soul, just out of disgust. Yeah, fucking <laughs> farmers. Get just, off my lawn. Just because it's Wednesday. Stop stealing my crops. <laughs> this is prime rubbish we're growing here. <laughs> Goddamn farmers and their rubbish. It's practically all they drop, or, or farmer clothes, you just watch shit clothes. Yeah. God damn it, I have to do all this again, because I wasted so much Estus on that little endeavor. Just for one fucking item. It's, let me just be sure what it does. Fading soul. Yo, fading soul, that's 50 souls. See? Use. 50. It's the first time I've ever, I've ever seen a game use the word smidgen. What's that? A smidgen, it's like a little bit. Does it say that? Yeah. Like a pinch, you know, kind of like it's, it, it's a smidgen. Does it Just say in the description or what? I'm pretty sure. If if you know, if not, point it out to me in the comments. But like, you know, it. I'm pretty sure it said smidgen. Smidgen. Smidge mom. It's like it was so weird for me to to hear the word schlep on TV. Why? Because I've only heard the word schlep being used by people I know. Yeah, me. All the time. <laughs> you do it, but like growing up as well, you know. My my mom would say. Yeah. And then her, hearing like an American say it, you know, like, ah, it's such a slap. You know, it's like, that's weird. You know? I'm slap it, It's the same as uh, in, in, and I thought this was an on, only an Afrikaans thing, uh, you know, a South African thing where uh, the word cock. Yeah. Like, K, like K-A-K or cack, you know. We, we we use the word and it was so weird I think it was the same with you like it's so weird he hearing someone else say that word like especially um, British people yeah but I think the first time I heard that word was in SS SSX Tricky I can't remember what the character's name was but he was he was, he was the tall black guy he was so cool though he, he was uh, he was one of my favourite guys to uh, to use but if he lost he went ah oh, cack <laughs> it's cool. <laughs> like, it's a naughty word. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when you're small, then, then, like, your parents pretend like saying that word is th the apocalypse has come. How dare thou say a word of that caliber of filth <laughs> in this house? But it's like it, it's it's one of those things that parents do where I, it's it's not necessarily the same as us because I mean we speak Afrikaans mainly, well not mainly but you know English is technically our second language. Um, but you know it's I, I think Americans have that thing where it's like if 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 parents start swearing in front of a kid then they try to you know change it like mother father you know. <laughs> But, <laughs> fudge. <laughs> There's another one that I can't think of now that was always like kind of like chuckle worthy to me. But, you know. Yeah, you know, Seinfeld has a whole thing about that. <laughs> a whole part of his stand up about just wholesome swear words. He's like, when you're, when you're a grown up, there's nothing more fun than coming up with, with wholesome swear words. <laughs> you know, fudge! <laughs> God, schmackle! Jackal. But I mean, uh, in school there was this girl who was like very much. I mean, you know what the Bible Belt is? What? No. The Bible Belt is like. The, Do they whip you with it? No, no, no. The Bible. <laughs> it's 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 like an. 
they'd refer it to an area where the Bible is like, you know, it's, it's super Christian there. Oh, uh, okay. Right? Now, I met a girl who was basically the embodiment of the Bible Belt. She was the Bible Belt, essentially, in school. <laughs> um, she was... You, uh, it really sounds like something that they'd whoop you with in church. <laughs> yeah. No, um, she'd... Uh, it, you remember Men in Black? Yeah. And the cat had the little uh, thing on his collar, and that was Orion's Belt. Yeah. That was like the encompassing of Orion's Belt. Yeah. She, she is the Bible Belt. <laughs> She's that. But, um, and if, and whenever we went like, you know, da, uh, darn or damn or, you know, or, uh, what's one that we'd use in Afrikaans to, it's almost like saying G's instead of Jesus. Yeah. Like, oh, geez. We, we'd say, oh, you see, <laughs> instead of, oh, you see, you know? Yeah. Um, and then, oh, God damn it. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> you fucking fine throwing assholes. But yeah, when we'd say like, ah, oh, geez, then yeah. she'd go, no, don't use that word. You know what you mean. <laughs> it's like, don't you, you're not even allowed to use the, you know, the polite version of it. Yeah, I, I, I like saying like, ah, oh, Jesus Christ or whatever. Same. <laughs> like, I, I, I'm not averse to blasphemy. I'm not religious myself. And um, when I was in college, there was this one girl. And like, she's the whore of Omaha. And she's in South Africa. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so long, that means... Long distance prostitution. Yeah, no, she'll fuck anything from anywhere. <laughs> oh, Christ, there's a guy with a big fucking rock. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she, what the hell is that? Oh, Jesus Christ. Right? See, Jesus Christ. <laughs> but then she'd smack me at the back of the head when I say that. And it's like, fuck you, you know? You join my conversation. I don't come say it in your conversation. Oh, shit, I'm rolling. 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 Really it's it's a bucket of poo. <laughs> <laughs> it is a bucket of poo. How much vitality do I need to carry this bucket of poo efficiently? I wonder if you can wield the bucket of poo. <laughs> it's a drop. <laughs> yeah, that's really funny. A drop. Look, it's got cack in it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like what real. smells like ass here? My weapon, <laughs> the bucket of ass. <laughs> it's like. Your bowels are in, or like the bowels of the dead all get, um, like the Egyptians got mummified and stuff when all these guys essentially become these dry husks and they get mummified, but all their ass intestines goes into that bowl for the ultimate weapon of stank. <laughs> it's like, do you dare fight me? Smell this. <laughs> no, this is a fate too dark for anyone to handle. <laughs> Oh fuck! I have no idea. I'm actually getting quite far now, and I'm nervous. Don't like, be nervous. You, you've got you, you 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 know you've you've got pretty good art armor. I apologize. That was my message alert. Oh, uh, we've got to put off. We forgot to put our phones on silent. I'm gonna do that quickly. Yeah, I'll give you my phone now. Here's a guy with a big ass fucking hammer. Hammer Bros. You know you thought you hated Hammer Bros in Mario. <laughs> These hammer bros come with hellhounds <laughs> included. They're called hammer bastards. The dogs are really like quite difficult to get down because they normally take more than one hit. And like they're very agile. So if you don't get your guard up at like the exact right moments, you're kind of in trouble. See, here's another hammer bros. Just like in Mario, there's always two. <laughs> oh no, that's a rake brother. Oh, okay. No. Yeah, never mind. He was a Koopa Troopa. Yeah. Here, yeah, Koopa Troopa. Let's see, is there something special here? Oh, there's, a, there's flowers. It's that's so beautiful. Too, that's too special. And then, as you walk. Maybe we should try putting that, so like serene music up here. <laughs> Depends on how how lazy we are in the editing process. Yeah, just, just beautiful, lovely, classical. No, we're not going to do that. There's a lot of effort. <laughs> It, it's a beautiful idea, but that's effort we're not allowed to go into. This this seems like something shit's gonna happen here. Great curse ridden tree ahead. Curse ridden tree. Transposing kiln lies within the belly. So I'm assuming there's like a boss thing. That sounds. That's not. Oh, okay. Oh. So I just came here for like no fucking reason. Fantastic. I always get surprised when I see those messages. Then I realize, oh, they're they're like offline messages. Yeah. Because we, we're still not on PS Plus. 
Let's see what's down this way. Yo, I don't know that that kill. That's where I came from. Uh, That kiln thing sounds like that's what they used to make that bowl of ass. (laughs) Oh, there's a whole area down here as well. Fun. So this place got big. Oh, there's another bowl of ass, man. (laughs) This one's got green poo. Yo, god damn it! I can smell you from here, man. Ow. He's ah. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> ah. Oh Christ. Yeah, I'm running low on Estus again. Jesus. What? Wow, that area of effect is ridiculous. Now he's got a saw. <laughs> he's like, I'm taking your bowels now. <laughs> this is for the hard shit. <laughs> 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 yeah, <laughs> sawing logs. So that it fits into the bowl, obviously. Duh. Jeez. Uh, uh, this is a fucking mine. Since you never eat, I'm assuming you're pretty constipated. Tell me. There's so many areas to go to. I think there's a bonfire here. And let's see. Yo, Yanin's watched some Let's Plays of other players. Yeah. I am. Um, yo, besides the bit that I played on my own. I'm pretty much blind. I hate rats in this game. Like, I don't want to be funny, but I hate rats. I hate them in Bloodborne. I hate them here. They're just asinine. They freak me the fuck out. That looks like the biggest rat that's there. Stupid rats. But the thing is, if they catch you off guard, then you're always poisoned. I don't like being poisoned. Oh, that's a stupid thing. I can't even pronounce it, but it's stupid. Looks like the other one was the biggest rat there. Oh shit, there's yeah, one Except thing. for this one. <gasps> <laughs> ah, see? I don't like rats. Oh, my health, my health, my health, my health. My health, my health, my health. <laughs> you rat bastard. <laughs> I knew about this one. Ah, you mean fuck, dude. I have no magic left. Oh, God. God. Damn it. I Jesus. <laughs> Christ, uh, thank God rats can't climb ladders and then the next thing you know he climbs the fucking ladder. <laughs> On the other side there's a bonfire. Is it? Yeah. I have no magic, I have nothing. Uh, can I shoot you with a dart? No, apparently not. Oh, I can. Have one dart. Apparently. <laughs> God damn you. Uh, only shot a little, dude. Don't, don't feel too chuffed. God damn, you're ugly. You're missing an ear. <laughs> Please don't bite my ear. He's missing some vital organs as well. See, the rats are creepy. You could have told me about that. <laughs> I'm gonna to shit myself on camera. You kept on complaining about it. And I had a little eye contact with the audience as well. <laughs> well, while you were I got a blood that. bite ring. That's cool. I don't know what it does. That's worth. The, that's worth the fat rat. Is it? That's the only fat rat. Yo, there was a, there was like a rat boss in Dark Souls 2. because I never really played much of it, but my friend did. Uh, and I helped him with that boss just randomly and it's annoying they're all like quite big rats mm. but the boss rat you can't he looks exactly like all the others and they just uh, spawn unendingly so it's so fucking hard to find him and there's like at least 40 on screen the whole time in a really small area I'm so low on health come on in your ass with broken glass in your ass with broken glass <laughs> up your ass with an arrow god damn fucking rats Jesus. Fucking Christ. Shit. You know, I need some key. I remember in my playthrough, I unlocked some prisoner NPC. I don't know if I did it on this one. I'm pretty sure I didn't. I don't know if I found the key. We must just look that up at some stage because there was some NPC and I did it last time when I found a key and I don't remember finding a key. Where's the bonfire? You tell me lies. Oh, then I'm probably confused about another area that also has, like, kind of a ladder area. I wonder what the fuck this ring does. Increases bleed Bleed resistance. resistance. Well, that's good good for this area with those fat bitches. It's weird. When you put it on, it immediately damages you with some of it. But the bar is, like, significantly larger. Hmm. It's interesting. Uh, That's funny. I'm over-encumbered now because of that ring. Really? <laughs> yes. So you can't run? <laughs> no. Well, I can't walk normal speed. Let's see. It's 0.6 and that pushes me 0.3 past my limit. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> see, all of a sudden, take this ring off. Oh, wow, I'm free again. <laughs> but the funny thing is you have it in your Bonfire. inventory. Bonfire. You have it in your inventory anyway. You know? 
the big difference about like I'm gonna put it on my finger. Oh god, I can't walk now. I'm just gonna put it in my pocket, then I'm fine. <laughs> yeah. Game logic. I really do um, dislike the fact that um, what do you call it? The strength stat doesn't um, increase your equip load anymore. There's a stat it's specifically better. for equip load. It's, I, I I dislike that incredibly much. Really don't appreciate it. Okay, well, yeah, because there's it, Fat it Dog Mendoza with his bowl of ass. Jeez, Fat Dog Mendoza, what a fucking blast from the past. <laughs> in a really mediocre past. <laughs> but I, 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 I like that cartoon literally just for Fat Dog. Yeah, that, it was a weird show. A really weird show. It, it was just a show that made me feel like, but. Yeah. I don't get it. Yeah. Because it's like this what, this kid with this fat dog that, that that doesn't really do anything, and they live with old people who were superheroes, apparently. I could have sworn I saw an item somewhere around here, and I can't find it. Okay, well now I'm here, and Doctor Assball is up there. <laughs> That's disgusting. Who fights people with a bowl of ass? But now he's got the hacksaw. It's all the rage here. Yeah, he's after my ass. <laughs> He's gonna saw up your ass and put it put it in the bowl. I'm sorry, I keep pushing the wrong button. I'll switch it at some stage. Come on, eat shit. Come on, dude. Let's see if you like getting sodomized the whole time. <laughs> ah! He should have saw ah! coming. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> I don't get smacked by this guy. Oh, I'm on the Farron dot. I don't want to be on a Farron dot. I want to be on a heavy soul arrow. Yeah, you slam the ground, like, plow a bit, help the farmers out, be a good citizen, while I peg you in the ass. <laughs> but I actually carry the shit that other people have because they don't have toilets. I wonder what his function is, because he's got, like, a door on his back. There's, is it like... He is the outhouse. <laughs> no, do you know what I think he does? It's like, for extra security, when the farmers go to sleep, he just stands in the doorway, and his back closes the door and if anyone knocks he turns around and they shit themselves and then he steals their assholes <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's his whole game no I thought that you know since people poo a lot I don't see any bathrooms around here uh, he is the bathroom he's the outhouse oh yeah gross he brings the bowl yeah and then they poop and it's like, would he's you like, like to shit sir no. donation yeah, it would be sure. funny like like this creepy guy with oh not good what the team? fuck what the Fuck, where the fuck's that coming from? It's the fucking, it's the giant in the Oh, house. I s <gasps> Jeez. <laughs> this guy's impaled? Yeah. Where? There he is. Oh, shitty fuck of goo. That's not good. <laughs> that is not good. It reminds me of the guy in Bloodborne who shoots you with Gatling guns. <laughs> Just look at this guy. It looks gun. like a fucking forest, but it's his arrows. Fading soul, ember, that was worth it. Young white branch. I don't know what the benefit of that is. Large soul, that's worth it, I guess. Watch out, there's a, a guy, guy with a hammer. hammer. And he slayed me. Well, thanks for the revenge, dude. Thank you. Like, I appreciate that because, like, you did damage me and that's why I died from him. But still, you, you, you killed him too, so we're, we're cool. <laughs> I, I forgive you now because I don't like the hammer, bros. The feud has ended with whoever that guy was. Okay, now we have to get the ass master again. <laughs> I have a donation for you, Ass Master. Yeah, I imagine that the Ass Master has like the most like royal British accent and he's actually like the most polite guy ever. It's like he's really polite, he knows what he's about, but like he doesn't like other people in the territory. Excuse and, me, would you like to poop? Yeah, excuse me, sir, would you like to take a shit? <laughs> Why well, yes, but only if you have a saw, because I have quite hard turds coming out of my bum hole. It's, it's like this one's stuck. <laughs> <laughs> now just imagine a guy shitting like, 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 uh, like Rand, like Stan's dad in that one episode. Yeah, and he like twirls <laughs> up, and then that guy has to come and saw him down like a tree. <laughs> I don't know what to do here. What I really need to do is grab this shit, and then... Oh shit, can I grab... What does this say? Arrows. 
There's something about arrows. Esters. Yo, yeah, well, how the hell? I can't drink Esters here. I have to uh, get away. Otherwise, yeah. that hammer bro is going to come and peg me. Unless he already killed the hammer bro for me. There's lots of yep, guys coming like, out. Uh, they're, they're, There's like a large a large group of guys. Do you see they're still coming out? Yeah, he keeps on killing. Yeah, so I wonder. I should maybe just wait here patiently. Jesus Christ, have you ever seen an arrow like this? Yeah, the, Fucking uh, hell. They drop stuff as well. Yo, I, which I have like literally no opportunity to grab. Mm -hmm. Get the hammer bro over there. Thanks, dude. Yeah, he, that guy in the tower is basically just doing target practice. Target practice. Yeah, I don't know. I can't really effectively collect these items. Yeah, because the thing is like... Reinforced. What did I get with the branch there? I couldn't read. Uh, reinforced something. Or another. Thank you. Reinforced garb? No. I don't know. I can't read because I'm running away from the arrows. Okay, I think... Until I solve the problem with him, I'm not going to. A guy inside you. Yeah, apparently a strong guy. The red eyes means they're strong. There we go. I think there, there might be. No, there's, there's another guy. I was mistaken. Whew, that guy's <laughs> really mean. Okay, I wonder if I can hop up. I think from the other side you can. Yeah, you can like jump on there. Oh. Did he peg you? Yes. Jeez. I can't really jump easily from that side, not without getting pegged by him. Yeah. Ah, I click. I must say, it's it's one of those things that I think I always complain about Dark Souls. I don't like the fact that they have jumping because I don't think the game needs more jumping. It should be the role like. Oh, cool! I got a side. Maybe the scythe is better than the um, the actual wielding. I ha highly doubt it, and I I'm pretty I'm pretty sure. Um, let's see. I think it does a little bit better. What's this one? This one's at 120, but this one is 105, but plus 18, so it's like two better. But it gives bleed, which is pretty nice. Mm -hmm. um, durability, but yeah, I'm gonna have to level up. A few times to use it so I'd like to use it because I like I like a scythe yeah it makes you feel badass then you can wear the robe and become the grim reaper the or, grim pajama man <laughs> yeah I was just gonna say the grim bathrobe the grim <laughs> bathrobe <laughs> where is my coffee with the slippers of death I feel like death today <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if this is those other doors they most likely oh. are Yeah, they yep, are. Yep, yep. Okay, well, I'm not going to disturb the guys on the chairs. Ach, stairs. <laughs> the chairs. The, the chairs. <laughs> That'd be funny. This <laughs> looks very boss roomy. Yeah. It's, it's got that that just hint of... What do you smell? It smells boss. Well, before we head in there, I think we should, we should we should call it for this episode. And then, like, maybe see the boss, you know... At the start of the next. Oh, if this is a shortcut, then yeah, this should be the boss room. Yes. Okay, maybe it's that big ass ugly tree that's gonna do something, or some guy's gonna fall from the sky. But in that, either way, it's gonna fucking fuck, fuck with you. <laughs> it's gonna be a tree, a guy, or something that falls from the sky. All right. But okay. Bye. <laughs> like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>